Hey, and also I want to add, also I would like to add that everything is on the internet. You know, a lot of times we just caught up in our day to day. And we focus on our struggles. We focus on certain insecurities we have. We focus on certain problems we have. We focus on certain areas where we just stuck. And with the spirit of power you have us from outside, hey, everything is on the internet. Just imagine, like the truth is on the internet. Can you imagine the truth? Things that people spend all their lives looking for is on YouTube. Starting with the Elder Apostles of Great Millstone. But also, everything you need to learn, every, almost everything you need to learn, all right, is on the internet, bro. Brothers and sisters, all right? How to, like, anything, like how to budget money is all on the internet. Things about females is on the internet. Problems with your car is on the internet, all right? Everything is on the internet, all right? So the internet can be a, a, a means of distraction or it can be a means of improvement. It can be a means of entertainment. Like I said, it can be a means of improvement, man. So a lot of problems you have, hey man, we live in a gold mine era, right? The new gold is really information because it's either in a book or it's on the internet, all right? Now, we've always had books, but Jake wasn't cultured in the West to just read books like that unless he's locked up, all right? Now, I can only assume Jake reads books when they're locked up. But a lot of Jake's culture we don't read. And it's going to say as best it is he who read it. And of course, you got to primarily read the word because it's the only thing you really need to read. But as far as navigating in Babylon, man, everything is really in the book, man. If you want to know the world around you, it's just in the book. It is shed light on certain things you're going through personally. It's in a book. Like, self-improvement, hey, that's the best tool you can have. You know? So, look, hey, with that, you know, like I said, everything is on the internet. I believe in the 1800s, we had something called a gold rush. Where um, everybody would move out west for the pursuit of gold. Right for the pursuit of gold, but the, the, the new gold is information because it's right, it's in the palm of your hands. The information is in your phone. Like how they say Google is your friend, like, it, even if it's something you got to pay for, it's probably no more than ten dollars, twenty dollars at the most, as far as the information. But that's going back to the first uh lesson I just did. That's part of investing in yourself. If you have to read this book to advance your game in life. Read it. All right? Drop your ego. Drop your ego and read the book. Read this book on how to improve, man. Because, like I said, we don't, we don't, we didn't come into this truth and become perfect. We came into this truth to be perfected. And like I said, a lot of problems you have, a lot of things that linger in your mind, a lot of those things can be solved, well, primarily from the scriptures. Because it says none of these should want her mate, meaning that you don't have to pair the Bible with like another religious book, man. But there's always tools of improvement, man. You can always improve yourself and learn new things, man. All right? Well, that'll be brothers and sisters with Edify to the next time, Shalom.